So right now with the recent increase in the assessed value versus the appraised value, which is the value that matters most to the buyer, what are you, how are you guiding people? What's most helpful? Yeah. So we have a lot of people that come in that kind of don't really understand the difference between that assessed and the appraisal, right? The assessed you're getting from your county, how much your house is worth, how much they're going to tax you on your house. Um, the appraisal side is what we need from our perspective to show your value, to show what other houses in the neighborhood have sold like yours, square footage wise, that type of thing. Um, where I think a lot of confusion comes into play on that is buyer gets their value back. They look at it. Well, this person's house down the street sold for X, you know, and there's a little bit of confusion on that side of things. It's all kind of based off of square footage, other houses in the area that have sold like that. So maybe the one down the street was another 500 square feet bigger. So it makes a little bit difference on, on that end. And then lot sizes and all of the other variables that go into that piece. The other variables that come into play, like, you know, attached, detached garage, anything along those lines that would add value to the property. Um, and, and we've had ones that have come back, you know, subject to, that means something needs to be fixed on the property. So if there's something that, you know, roof needs to be replaced or something along those lines, and it has subject to in there. So we'll want to watch for that as well. Um, and then we do have underwriters that kind of scrub those appraisals and go over and say, hey, you know, this, maybe we need another comp because this one's out of line or comparable because it's out of line. So we have people that look at that value too, to make sure that we're taking care of your investment. And then all of your appraisals, they are guidelined through Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac, correct? Yep, correct. So we have those underwriters go through them and there's certain ordering process. So we use a few um, appraisals in the area and we have no idea who gets them. So can be anybody who comes in or one of our approved ones that comes into the house and does the appraisal. So it's, it's totally, um, you know, on their, their market opinion. 